I'm just gonna put that out right there. And now the tweet has been made, so now I feel fine to start the like content part of the broadcast. Hello, hello, and welcome. My name is Nick. Uh, today I'm gonna play a game. I saw it on Twitter earlier, and it is called. Let's see if I remember my hotkeys. I don't know if my hotkeys work anyway, uh, but I have to hit this button. Rolo Tomasi. Yeah, listen to that. All right. Um, so basically, I saw this described as an alternate, uh, yeah, an alternate physics platformer, which we can get into that later. But it's a, it's a, the idea of alternative physics really sends a chill down my spine in a way that won't leave me alone. So I just want to take a look at it. Uh, I have not started this. I really, I launched the executable and got to this title screen just to make sure it was getting into the OBS and now we're going to take a look. I got my coffee. Excuse my sips. All right. Let's see. Let's learn about alternative physics. Uh, so this is a pre pre alpha. Okay. Mouse does nothing. Okay. I can go forward and turn. All right. Got coin. All right. Like, you, you'd think I would have noticed something about the tree being sideways, but no, just... Alright, get a key. And I guess the key is what is... He could... Ten sec... Uh, fine, I can do better. Nice little rewind hit on that. Okay, so, so far, I'm just getting like a... Uh... No, you know what? That's rude to, to, to have impressions after one level. All right, let's give it a little more. Okay. Oh, I have a jump. Can I? All right, good. No, that, that's that's important to know. There's a very stickiness to the movement on this. Um, like, I'm holding the key for like almost half a second before... Sometimes the jump just doesn't go at all, but I can like hold the key for half a second before it decides to go. I'm wondering if there's like a extra long like ignore input window after a turn. Cause like you stop turning and then you wait, then it'll think about taking your input. Uh, but yeah, this is like a, okay. Okay. And we have the white telling, oh, hey, there's more level down here. All right. Does that mean we can, okay. So we don't need to follow the path. No, we do. No, we don't. How was I able to, is it because it's like a one peg? Cause like, oh no, I can go here but I can't go off the path? No, how do I get there then? I go roll this way? Huh, I don't quite understand. You can't go sideways, but if you're on an end peg. Hey, what about doing this? I can do that. Huh, that's unclear why I can go at certain points and not others, but okay. Okay, desert world. Okay, so I can just go like this. I can't do that, but I could do this. I mean, all right. I There's a there's I don't like that you can't go backwards actually. That's the most upsetting thing right now. Um, how about this side? Nothing. There's a whole thing over there. Can I jump? Uh, I gotta know. Ooh, okay, I touched it. Yeah, okay, so if I just sort of stand here and hold, I'm holding the left arrow and it's, that's how long each individual turn is. 
Yeah, I think that's what I'm getting. Uh, right. We said it was up this top side. Having, like, mouse control to look around, keypad, no, nothing. Okay, why? It's not wasad, because it's wad. You can't go backwards, so don't use that, so I don't know. Um, hmm. All right. I guess I live on this cube. Like I see, can I just, no, the jump goes forwards. What if I do this? Yes, okay. Oh, hey. Okay, and then it lined up. So, see, camera control, really important. Um, so I can't go, am I stuck now? No, there's gotta be a way out. There's coins here. I don't know if anybody watched my uh, Sh Doom Shareware playthrough, but I was talking about how uh, pickups are kind of a... That's just rude. Pickups are kind of a contract from a level designer to say, hey, no, this is explorable space. I put something here that you could get, which means you can go here. I'm... So also if I do this, so like I can jump here and yeah, I'll land down here. Uh, so, yeah, okay, that's the spike, so I need to go all the way back. How do I get into the middle? Okay, so, I do like the, um, that we have, like, a free fall over here, because now, like, I'm going to do this and land here. I, I do like this as... Uh, what, what am I saying? I'm distracting myself. I like this aspect that uh, when you leave a surface, you're being put into free fall, and it's whatever way was down when you jumped. I feel like, again, I'm going to... Oh, and that's it. Okay, got it. Right, proof of concept. <sighs> Coming days. Okay, uh, well, there, there you go. They didn't put, like, the actual, well, Google Softs, I guess. Um, oh, it said it here, Jump. I, I apologize, game creators, that I did not read the very clear instructions that you put on screen for me. That's my bad. Okay. Um, oh, I still didn't make a title card. Hey, remind me to do uh, another art stream and make a title card for this. Because I kind of want to just talk about this, and I don't have a camera up right now. Shoot, do I have a camera up? I don't want to. No, I look gross today. I'm not going on camera. Uh, well, we're going back to this for a minute. Okay. Uh, that's kind of interesting, actually. Uh, like, uh, I, I already made the Ilo Milo, Ilo Milo, whatever you want to call it, comparison. And I like the shit out of that game. And that was very much the same thing but like they they very much did the thing where it's like okay when you can go around corners we put a specific like we put that carpet which they in the one level they did with the path where it wrapped around the edge but then the it's not accurately expressing what the rule is because the rule is if you're on a single square you can roll over any of the edges which that's a that's a that's a fine mechanic that's like a specific unique probably thing um but I don't Milo didn't have jumping. There's no, uh, as far as like block climbing goes, I'm thinking of Catherine, which had very like a lot of specifics about like climbing edges and pushing. This doesn't have any pushing or anything like that, but like, um, I, I could, the, I could see a game like this having like climbing mechanics. Like, oh yeah, no, as long as it's one block high, you can climb up it. Uh, but no, this one just has like, free range jumping and that's i don't think i've seen that in a game quite like this before where it's very much about like strict rules on gravity uh and that's kind of the let me let me bring it back here just so we're not on the standby screen uh i, I like being the director if i wasn't the one on camera i would still be the one back here clicking buttons and changing transitions let me tell you that uh 
but yeah, when they talk about the 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 free range, I mean, is interesting, and I think you can kind of work with that. It actually makes me think of uh, so I, when I read it this morning. That's the the thought I kind of started having is that like, okay, what do you mean by alternative physics? Because I mean, yeah, first thing is gravity isn't what you think it is. It's like an empty ester painting, which, okay, we're walking on the bottoms of things, you know, we're doing this, different things are considered ground, fine, we're kind of there. Uh, but that kind of gets you into the concept of like, well, does that just mean that jumping works? Like, if, okay, if, if just gravity works differently, then theoretically, um, V, 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 and Gravity Days both uh, count as alternative f- physics games. But that's like, I, I I feel like that's more like gravity bending platformers, you know? Um, to be fair, I didn't really play Gravity Days. I know there's like a, a character action aspect to it. But like you say, oh, that game where you say this way is down now. And that's the game you're talking about. Um, so like, that's like, even if you do want to consider those like physics alternatives, there's there are known alternatives at this point. So like, okay, sure, I guess. Um, when I think alternative physics, I almost think something more like antechamber, which was you know very non Euclidean, very like the where spaces are n- not static where like relative distances and connections are not static so it's like hey what it like o- almost like you know when you're in like a Mario game and there's a section where, like, here's a floating cube of water. So you jump up into it, and then you're swimming in any direction through it, and then you leap out the other side. Like, that's, uh, like, to say alternative physics is, like, okay, take the rules of physics that you know about, like, gravity, yes, but also just, like, mass and conservation of momentum and just, like, how force is imparted. Just, like, think of things like that and, like, we're going to twist some of those rules. So like, like, like it, it, it's, it, it, that, that phrase awoke in me and, and just sort of like evoked rather like kind of, uh, eld, like eldritch physics, just like, it's like, Oh no, no, no. Like the very core thing, you know, about your world, about like how things like move and interact and have natural properties. We're going to twist those. So it's like, okay, what are you offering me? Because that's, like, I'm not very creative. So that's, I, that is beyond my imagination. It's like, okay, well, I mean, the thing we start with is like, feathers behave like seal and seal behaves like feathers or seal behaves like rubber. It's like, okay, okay, well, that's like bad reskinning. But like, you know, there's, there's, there's something, there's something to that. Or, Or like, just imagine like, buoyancy right something that has all of the properties of steel except buoyancy works opposite so like the less dense or er, er, yeah yeah no so like the less dense something is it sinks in water or like yeah it, it like 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 there are little turns that you can make on it and like alternative physics would be like hey let's you know look at a bunch of the you know properties of matter afforded by physics and let's just like flip a couple of switches about how things react so like i don't know something that's something that sinks in water floats in air you know like like just like work and then just like create a new set like that so it's like you know it's like that it's like oh uh bouncy things will bring something like almost sort of way that like the, the, the Newton's cradle works. So it's like, Oh, something if, as long as it's rubber, anything that hits it completely stops. And then it takes off at, you know, the same velocity. So, you know, you just like, but the, but then see, that's because the thing about physics is that physics is like the complete set of rules. So it would be like, here are things that all objects in this, in this system obey by. I, 
I wasn't expecting all of that when I sat down to this game. I figured they would be like, take a little bit of it and like, sure, gravity. But like another game where gravity is like, oh, you can roll on the other side of things. Like, listen, let's talk about. I don't have a good one right now. I keep thinking of, of Geom Cube, which is a game I want to play at some point uh, on, on a stream. I would need to rope somebody else in, but I don't know anybody. I I live on the grid. I am alone here. It's how I want it. What, that's whatever. Um, but that you know, that's basically two sided Pac Man, where you're playing on the same the same board in air quotes, but one player is on the top side, one player is on the bottom side, but they just make them symmetrical, you know. So it's it's still uh, even. It it's very esports. I like it. For that reason, uh, I don't like it for that reason, but I appreciate it very much for that reason. <laughs> um, uh, no, nobody else likes it as much as I do. I, I, I don't, I don't know. Uh, that's why it's on me to run these streams and show things off like that. Whatever. Oh, but you just like walking on the other side of things. Like I've played that game before. Um, hey, you know what? Your devs, you're making something. Good on you. Keep working on it. Do something cool. Um, but that's kind of the thing. It's like, do something like, like I said, the most interesting thing that I saw in this game is free jumps in, in one of these games. Like, cause free jumping just in games in general, just gives you a really like a, a level of explore exploration agency that you, once you can jump, you can start breaking games, right? Cause it, it gives you like between like how your jump speed physics works like what fr like at what point in in uh, a frame update are you checking hit collisions like when when you say you you can't skyrim up something unless you can first jump you know what i mean so the idea of bringing that into a system where you know up and down aren't necessarily always there. Like, like I can like, like all of the, the little stuff that was floating in the background, if that wasn't just decorative, but like the levels were designed that if you stand in one specific part that may not be obvious, but just like, if you look at how things and, and like as a secret thing, it's like a side uh, uh, or like side collectible, it's just like, Oh, there's that thing over there. That must be part of the background. No, actually, if you stand on this side of this block over here, then you get over there or like, like yeah, there, there's there's something to that that that'll give a game like that much more space. Probably also make it a bit harder. Or like at some point, stop making it. Um, you know, don't lock it to the the cube grid that the levels are built out. I'm fine if you build your levels out of cube. That's easy. I love stuff like that. It, it's I I appreciate it as a level designer that it's very quick to build levels that way. But like. I should really just play Gravity Days. I haven't had a, a PlayStation console since a PS2, so I haven't really had a chance to, to check that out. But, like, I don't know. That's, like, Gra Gravity Days is kind of it. Because, like, here's your, your gravity bending, you know, whatever. It, it, that's, that's almost the thing. It's, like, getting your gravity to be in a specific direction one of six if you're working with cubes but to have it be in a specific direction and then you know using that to access new locations like that's that's a pretty good puzzle mechanic like that's kind of what all of these are but like to put it into like a sort of free run like that's the thing do this game but with cylinders and then you know you have a you have a jump off a cylinder because as soon as you have a cylinder it's like okay well now i have like free direction travel but only you know rotating around one axis which is the axis of a cylinder that's that's a limitation that creates a challenge so that would be all right i'm going on on this for a long time did i mention i miss being on a podcast where i can just talk about this stuff for a while but um that was pretty good and i'm going to say that uh keep 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 working on that thing that's cool i'm gonna switch games though uh Oof, I'm gonna after I have another sip of coffee here. Hang on one second. Mmm, appreciate that pop filter listening audience. Uh, also, hey, I should bring up the Twitch chat in case anybody comes by, because that happens uh, sometimes. The there it is. Pop out. I'm going to stick this over here. 
I can work with that. All right. Uh, let's bring this back over here. Okay, I had a feeling that that wouldn't last too long, so I threw something else uh, in the queue. What window did I leave it in? Okay. Um, let me mute this while I got this set up. Uh, I should also probably throw out another tweet about we're changing over games. So excuse me while I do that for a hot second too. Whoa, okay. I didn't expect it to take full screen and capture my mouse. Great. Oh, that's, that's a rad music. I need to turn it down on my headphones. Excuse me. Oh my God. What is going on? Oh, uh, Hey everybody. Okay. What I'm doing is I'm putting out a tweet saying, uh, where's me? Uh, and the thing, and then, uh, ah, y'all don't need to know about that. Don't worry. Okay. Tweet sent. Uh, I come into here. I'm looking for this, this, I'm going to change this one over to this. Oh yeah, let's um that needs to go yeah, about there. I can live with that. Uh let's bring this over and we'll unmute and here we go. Uh this is a get whoa boy. Oh I love this. What is Scooch? Oh Scooch. Yeah, no, you want Scooch. Okay. I am not using what I do. What I do? Help. Help. I'm using a keyboard, dog. Help. Help. Uh, can I not do full screen just for There we go. That's Hang on. I only edit it while it's on. Well, that's not true. Okay. Now I'm here. Now I'm here. Shake, erase data, back. Tutorial? This is my. Okay. Z, C, control. Hey, can I get any. I'm looking. No keys. No mouse, control, alt, shift, space, does that. Hold up and swing to reach higher. Is one of these keys swing? I would really like to play this game. I bet you it's space and it's just not working there. Uh. Okay, this is Aliens Go Home Run. Nope, I still don't have a slide. I don't have a did. This is unfortunate. So this is a game. Okay, press key for keyboard or button for um keyboard. Okay, left, right, up, down, slide, swing, power up. Okay, Let's try this again. Swing. All right. Oh. So the concept is that this is like a breakout style game, but also baseball. So you have this person here who's, ooh, okay. Um, you, you're, you're using a little person and you have this sort of angle thing. There, there's a human conceit to it. How about that? 
Okay. Okay. Let's play this game. Uh, this is another one. I kind of saw it on... Like... I think I saw it on Twitter. It's, you know, it's like, oh, hey, my friend made this indie game. And I was like, I, I like me a breakout game. Get him. Oh, okay, so... Alright, it's like... Not not Contra. What, what am I thinking of? It's like Life Force. Where my... I'm collecting, like, power-up baubles, and then depending on how many I get before activating them, that changes what I get. Okay. Up there. Touch. Okay. 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 I like this a lot. Still says slide through the bullets on screen. Okay, so I have, like, manually activated multi-ball right now, I guess. I want shoot, because of course you want shoot. Okay. The, the, the sound in this game, the... It's a one. Okay. Okay. Oh. G goodbye. Oh. Multi-hit bricks. Got it. Huh. There's something to be said for... There we go. Get him. Dunk on him. Uh, 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 a game of this style where... Well, a breakout game when there's gravity on the ball, where it's not a perfect... Um, it doesn't travel on a perfect trajectory, you know? Also, like, very discreet aiming controls, because, like, I can hit up to make the angle shallower, but also to have it go up higher. I want that. There we go! I want these. Bonus save so I can get these, please? Nope. All right. I, I, I don't know how long this game is. This is a... a this is available on Steam. I want to say it was, like... Like two bucks when I bought it, buck ninety nine. Use the ball. Got him. There we go. There we go. Not the best. Oh, I lost my my. I lost my beam. I like my beam. What is the is the heart just like a extra hit or something? So this is definitely also kind of in the vein of a uh, bot vice that I played. I guess that was two weeks ago. Um. Where it's like part a target game, part a a bullet dodger because you are a person at the bottom of the screen. Got him. So it didn't like split the ball, did it? It just gave me a gate. Oh, oh, it's fading. Huh. Ghost ball. Or is it like fading for every time it's hitting the ground or something? So as long as I can keep juggling it, it'll stay. Hey, can I just... There we go. 
That's not bad. I, I, I like... Listen, there was a lot of things I liked about Wizorb. But being able to get very, like... Getting very discreet control over the angle of the ball does a lot for a game like this because it's, you know, it's kind of shuffleboard rules or it's crokinole where it's like the challenge, the challenge, the part where you're limited, the challenge you have to overcome is that you're stuck to the bottom plane. So if you want to like, so it forces you or when it's good and giving you a, an interesting challenge, it's forcing you to make trick shots about like, okay, what position, what angle, Especially when you don't have like a, a guide laser, because then you have to just like, okay, I can only make the shot by making four bounces. So I get to pick, you know, I get one, I get two variables, position and angle, and then I, I just have to foresee that my I, I'm like estimating my my further three bounces right. I really I really like a game like that, and, but in something like that, that's you know, regular Arkanoid, you kind of get position, but you're also limited it's you some sometimes depending on the game you also get angle about whether it's like <sighs> different games do it differently so it's like if you're it's like it can be sort of like it's a depending on how close you are to the center is how close to a straight up hit you will get or sometimes it's not you know the straight leave angle but it's the closer you are to the center of the board, the more perfect the reflection will be off of the paddle. Um, sometimes it's like the middle is like a large chunk of the middle is a perfect reflection, and it's just like uh, you know a certain amount of pixels on each edge that you hit it with that will cause it to have a different reflection. Sometimes it's based on if the the paddle has moved on the current frame, that means that it'll affect the 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 angle. So like you can hit it in the middle, but if you slid, if you were moving while it touched, it'll add the movement to the the, the vector, I guess. I, I, I swear I keep talking about this in terms of like building the from the mechanical side. Um, so it, there's, I actually don't even know which one I would say I like the most. Never, never even mind the games where you can actually tilt the paddle itself. Um, but I like this very much. There's an arrow, and it, at every state, it tells you it's gonna go this way. I can deal with that. That's very clear. That's that's one of the things about games. Is in a good game, the choices available to you are very clear, but what the best choice is is very unclear. You know. A game that makes you go, wait, that's even an option? Every time you say that, that like... Okay, there's sometimes where that's good. Like, that's like a, a very, like, the witness kind of thing. I guess it's the last one I can think of where it's like... I'm, I'm, I'm sure there's more recent ones, but that's the last one, big one I remember where it's like... If, if you do have a mechanic... If you have an option available to you, but it is not clear to you, it can't be like a core mechanic like it can't be like oh to open this you know main story blocking door you have to understand that this can happen it has to be like this is a totally optional thing this is how you 100 percent the game but to get to an ending you'd be like oh okay i all of the like regular stuff is available to me and then like or, or like using things in combination can't should, shouldn't necessarily be spelled out you want to leave that room for a player to feel like a genius uh what buttons were my fingers on I was gesticulating and completely lost my hand placement. This one. Whoops. Okay, if we're not going to too much, do too much else with like. brick or ball options, I guess adding more bullets is kind of the way to go to make levels more interesting. I was trying to parry those bullets. Did you call it Bat Beam? Oh, can you, like, Lethal League style bunt the ball? Yo, you want to talk about Lethal League for a minute? Lethal League. 
Is this like a, a spiritual prequel to Lethal League? Because I would totally be behind that, actually. <laughs> Like, this was baseball combat as a desperate solution to the alien invasion. And then they were like, oh, what if we, like, did that to each other? Because humans are always looking for a new blood sport, I guess. I guess. Um, I just appreciate, like, any game with where you have to, like set trajectories for projectiles, you know? Espe especially ones that have, like, a... Because, you know, arguably it's like, oh, that's like a first-person shooter. Rocket Arena, yes. I'm not really into, like, hitscan weapons. I, I, I've i enjoyed an Instagib round or two in my time, but I definitely prefer, like, Rocket Arena, like, shot combo only, you know what I'm saying? That's totally lost on anybody who has never actually played uh, Unreal Tournament. But, like, Le Lethal League is, is very much the same thing. Like, that game is... See, that game is interesting because the difference in characters, which does actually bring it more up to speed with a fighting game, is the characters are afforded... The, the thing that changes them up is not just, like, the one special move, but they also get different angles for most of their hits. Um, and then, like, the options of which hit angles you have is even grander when you realize that like you have like up tilt down tilt and then aerial up and down neutral up and down tilts and side tilts i forget i haven't played that game in a minute but um like that's the part where you need to like memorize characters in order to understand matchups it's like okay who like who has good angles because otherwise that game is entirely about like it's the timing which i like the timing um, aspect to it is very uh, Kirby's Megaton Punch. No, what's I, I don't know. It's the other Kirby's Superstar uh, mini game in there. The the timing one. I like I like a good reaction time game, but like it's all about like okay, I'm gonna be here. Here are the angles I have. How can I put this where he is or where he is going to try to go to when he dodges? Because he'll assume that I'm gonna hit him where he is. Like. At some point, the game just gets so fast that you can't really even, like... It... it you can't, like, consciously think about it at that, that level, but that's, like... The skill that you're building up is to be able to read and make those decisions at, like, snap instants. So, that's... I like that game a lot, too. Whoa! Okay. Hell yeah, boss fights. Okay, that's a lot of bullets. Hey, ball. Uh, stay up there. Mess him up. Oh, these are gonna... Whoa! Get him. That hit him. Oh. Get him. Was that three? That was three. That's a laser. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That's four. How many hits do you have? Oh, that's a... Got him? Got him? This is my ultimate form. What? Oh, have like every... Okay, have like all three of the... the... Okay. Oh, is the overlay not showing up today? Okay. <sighs> okay, okay. Powerful bullet patterns. Are those, uh, like, permanent bumpers right there? I should just be working this out. You do this ball. Be fierce. Mm. It's gonna 
might be. Oh gosh, what's even going on? Right, it doesn't loop. Ah, what? I was kind of expecting it to be like when the ball came to a complete stop, that would be um, like a, a lost life game over state. Like, nope, gotta. Like, listen, we'll give you a lot of leeway here. It can, like, touch and bounce, but it can't come to a complete stop. Hit it. Okay, sure. <sighs> hmm. I started a little late, didn't I? Let's keep going. Whoops! Alright. Okay. Here. And here. Come on, stay up there. I'll focus on dodging. You just do work, ball. Hi, welcome to work ball, the worst sport. Let's just get these moving. Oh, I finally took a hit. Good thing I had my bubble. I just need these to get right. There we go. I like that the slide pops it up. Right, that's what got me on the topic of um, Lethal League. Hey, you like that? I can mash on the table and it won't uh, <laughs> make the noise now. Okay. That was weird. Did that one guy spit out that pattern? Also, how did the... Oh, the ball went through that leftmost enemy to get up there. Got it. Eh, I might as well. There we go. Yes! Yes! Okay. Oh, can I just? Ah! That's one. Oh, fair play to the queen. She killed a crazy dog. Uh huh. Oh, okay, but so the. No, wait, is me hitting the ball? Killing that combo? Is the combo doing any from, anything for me other than score? Because I haven't cared about score since like 1993 when I was four years old. Whoops. Dirt. Come on. There we go. All right, now you'll figure it out. Okay, I can't actually hit the heart as a power-up. So I'm guessing that's something passive. Yeah, it's just kind of going to work over here. Hey, what if we had more balls? Uh, in Espanol, mas cojones. Uh, 
I don't know if it's like the the like relative size of the blocks, or whatever. But I feel like if you're in that good spot where the the balls are up there taking care of everything, there's like so little for you to do down on the ground. You're just like, yeah, it's. I got a good setup, I guess. There's something with. Okay, there's like stereo panning based on where you are on the screen. That's. Maybe not great? Especially because it's. Unless I have my headphones backwards, I would do it the other way. Where the. Because right now it sounds like the sound is coming from you, so when you are standing on the left side of the screen, the sound is coming from the left. But I would have it sound like the sound is coming from the center of the screen. Hey, it's this guy again! Yeah, yeah okay, goodbye. I can kite all day. Well, okay, that's a lot of bullets. That's more bullets than I was expecting. Oh, I still have the, the Zappy Blade. Whoops. That's a real hit. Okay. I don't know if that ball despawned yet. Okay. Nope, it's fine. Whoa, rude. I had sphere. There we go. Bubble. Stop. Okay. Is that it? How many more? Okay. Okay. No, I get it. You got little buddies. All right. I, I couldn't even play now if I wanted to. I'm at the game or the the stage finish screens. Oh, really? There's more levels. And so, yeah, apparently there is like a level editor in here, which I'm psyched about. 16 minutes, huh? No strikes, no outs. Okay. Oh, that's what this... Right. Baseball. Okay. So, I guess maybe the heart repairs a strike. And you get three strikes. That's why I have empty boxes at the top instead of having hearts somewhere on the screen. Okay, fine. Baseball. I get it. <sighs> Alright. I'm... Um... I wonder how long this is. Whoops, whoops. Right here, no, but that, woo, that'll do me. There we go. Uh-huh. Bubble. <laughs> Bubble. And pop. Pop. I wonder if sliding into the corner will stop my momentum or if I'll just stay in one spot and have iframes. Okay. That's rough. That's going to be... Those guys are real close. Here. Oh, no. I took the hit. I'll take that. So are those dropping... Those are dropping based on, like, brick breaks, right? But they're not... Dropping from where the brick broke from? Hi, I'm Brick Broke From, and welcome to the Action 9 News. Oh, I don't like this. Okay.
Those bumpers are killing me, though. Ah, he's back! My baseball's back, and he's better than ever for Christmas this year. Some baseballs here. There you go. There you go. And bubble. All right. Now I'm feeling brave again. Listen, for some fine courage in a in a, a bottle. I just find it in a bubble. Jeez. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Nope. That was well. Okay. Oh, come on. One more over here. There. Got it. There we go. Okay. Yeah, no, that feels really good. Like, you technically only get, like, four direction options, but also, like, they're very discreet, and there's enough, like, that, whoa, that was, that's weird physics. But it's not breaking my experience. Oh, hey, those guys are big. What? Also, like, Spitwad Willy talking about, like, locked axis games with a gravity conceit. Oh! Got it! Okay, <laughs> I understand your mechanic now, buddies. Oh, boy. Do they have a delay? Is that it? Or is it... work and got him oh bonus round Touch that, yeah. Nope, should have hit it here. Nope, wrong way. Okay, okay. Okay. Sure, I don't know what I'm... Oh, I do have an ammo counter down there. Okay. Interesting. But yeah, I don't know. It feels like there's something weird about the, uh, like, brick size ratio. They're just very wide. It makes it feel like there's not enough screen real estate for... Eh, I don't know what to say for. There you go! Gosh, so how are you supposed to destroy them if you don't have, uh, lasers? Hey, can you get that guy for me? There you go. Yeah. Again. Oh, didn't hit me. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it really kicks a lot off of those. Yeah. Okay. There you go. First hit. What? Fourteen levels in. Out of I don't know how many.
Oh, and there is a time limit. I didn't even notice that before. Okay, yeah, and then the heart removed the strike. Okay. And we finally solved that mystery. <sighs> this is cute. This is cute. Oh! Oh, you can... You can... I got it. I stand here. I... No, I can't. Or is it... What? Ah! Stop that. I'm doing science. Leave me alone. <laughs> no, Mom. <laughs> I ain't on drugs. I'm just doing science. Can I have a peptide? All I wanted was just one peptide, and she wouldn't give it to me. Okay. Oh, look at this guy. Uh, I don't... Okay. Okay, there we go. Wow! Okay. That's rough. Okay, and then... That's real rough, actually. I'm glad this ball's bouncy. I'll dodge. You do the work. Oh, come on. Oh! No. Get up there. Arrgh! Nope. I swear it's not like calculating my lives right. Nope, that time is there like a wind up on the on the slide? I need to get to that. Mmm That way. Ugh. Right there! Come on, come on, come on, come on! Yeah, right there. I totally got a strike, but I don't have it. Come on, come on, come on, come on! There we go. I mean, he he did it to himself, but I'll take it. Huh. <sighs> hmm. And there's a team for that. Okay, yeah. I want to keep going with this. It's, uh, well, you know, this ain't bad. Oh, hello. Wait, no, what was that? What is A? Uh, was I on the stage before? Stage A for also this one. All the way through. Okay. Yeah, there's like a big window on the end of that slide. I ain't complaining. I'm just saying. Hit him? Alright. Ah, see, but there I took a hit. There's gotta be a thing that, like, the hitbox when you have a bubble is bigger than when you don't have a bubble. Or maybe they just decided to, to err on the side of players who evade early. And then just say, like, oh yeah, no, like, you might not have that the distance to cover it at the end, but we'll give you a bigger window. Yeah, it could be. Sure. Oh, okay, okay. Oh. Yep, nope, got it. Lots of, ah, okay. This might be the first level that straight up, like, kills me. 
Ugh. Where's the ball? There it is. Dang it! Okay. Okay. Ah. Like, I would agree that they've made it harder. Does that make it a more fun level? I don't think I would say that. No. Okay. Huh. Maybe I am going to call it done over here. Yeah. Because if the ball will get up there and do the work on its own, I'll deal with hitting people. But that's just like such a dense enemy layout. right there. I thought I slid through him. But yeah, the slide distance that starts you and ends you in in the, the, the thwomp radius, that's rough. Okay, okay, okay. Nope! Okay! That's what I was worried about. I didn't want him to come back. Ah! <laughs> so close. Oh no, so again, you gotta just start that that's that streak really early. The, the slide, and then you can slide through these guys. And I think that is doing damage to them. Okay. Okay, that changes things a bit. Ugh. Yeah, okay, and that's... Okay. All right. You just gotta start it so early. And then once you clear them out, that's... Okay, that's making way more space. Uh-huh. Could you stop shooting? I need to get to where the ball is. Ah. Gosh, that's so many bullets. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Ball, just hit it. here. need to get over here and put the ball this way. No! The delay! You, you forget! 
Oh my gosh! Nope. Those guys up top have got me on tilt. Ah. back oh, come on come on come on come on touch it once more that's a great start with the wrong buttons I didn't even touch the ball yet I'm not saying it's even close to fair, but I am saying it's an engaging challenge because it's like, oh yeah, you know, just dodge the bullets and hit the ball. The ball will do its own work and you're going to... No, this one... This one's kind of trying to put my foot in my mouth for me. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. In here? That's wrong. I'll take this though. Okay, so I gotta go under and that, and I can hit him there. Here's a new one of these. Give me a bubble. See, they respawn, so it's almost not worth going after them. If you want it to end, you just gotta go after the, 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 the blocks. But there's so many bullets that you're just so limited in, in your, your, like, actionable space. Touch it. Yep, okay. That's the one that got me last time. Ah! Come on, so close. Okay. Oh boy. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I gotta look at it. I can't. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I like these don't hide in the corner rooks over here. Why is my phone lighting up? Nope. It's okay, I got one heal. Just get on, there we go. You go on top, I'll deal with this. Okay. I maybe would disagree about how that should have worked, but just in terms of me getting hit, I think that leaned on my side. <laughs> oh, let's breathe for a hot second. Okay, hello. Oh no no no! I need. I was checking my phone.
Is it giving me enough of a window to start another slide? Maybe? Wow! That's... huh. Looks like it, don't it? Huh. Maybe not. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe not on a... hmm. One day I'll, I'll be where the ball is again. Two ships passing, you know what I mean? Uh, yep, that's why exactly why he's there. You know, bullet kiting, you run into the corner, and then you run into the other corner. That was a considered dick move, is what that was. Come on, I just gotta get it over there. Okay. No. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This is the last one right here. Okay. Oh, that one was easier, which makes me think I should go forward again. Uh... Oh, is there going to be like a special boss? Oh, this guy sucks! Okay. Okay. Oh, did they like lose sight of you if you're in a hit stun? Oh, that's what's doing it. Interesting. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, oh, I got him. Oh, I got him. There we go. There we go. There we go. That's some work. That's not good. Okay. I mean, the bubble's good because it, 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 even though it's kind of, it's better than just the X, then it's better to have a bubble than to heal a heart later because it uh, blocks you the hit stun. Come on. Oh, come on. Oh, come on! Done? One more? Okay. Ooh. Okay. Please, anything. I mean, not that I care. It's not like... Like, continues don't seem to be a concern. You just get, like, three hits and then it's start over. <sighs> I this is probably a boss, right? All right, I should. If this is a boss, I should take a look at this, and then I think I'm gonna call it quits. I got other stuff I should probably do today. Not a boss. I'm not saying not like some difficult garbage, but not. I need to... Hey, I need to borrow this? Mm-hmm. Oh.
<sighs> okay. I should get the side ones. There we go. Oh boy, that is so many bullets. Oh boy! All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. Nope. Oh, whoa. Okay, I can, I can maybe deal with this. Now I don't have to worry about getting it sideways. Now that it's got a very clear path to get straight up. Oh, I see. It's touching them, and then that's giving them a real big jerk. With their cover of take on me. Nope, that's... Ah, oh, come on, come on, come on. mash on swing as the game started and it Ugh. that hit sun is real <laughs> nope. I did. Ah, he's right there. <laughs> I don't know why those guys get me so good. Jeez. Nope. All right. Come on. Okay, okay, I'm breathing. The ball's doing some work. Let's get that other out. St uh, strike, I guess? These are strikes. I saw him too, I was specifically thinking, I need to not get hit by him. And then he immediately stomped on my face. Ugh. Yeah, no, that, that window between, like, it's the spread on these guys' shots make it so hard. Man, his delay is 
Smaller than the swing recovery. Wow. Okay, that's the problem. That's a problem I'm having. How about that? The problem I'm having is bullets. Is it worth it to focus on taking these guys out? Probably not. I can't, like, get a good in and out with all the bullets. Oh. <sighs> No, there's so many bullets, you can't stay on one side. It, like, takes a back and forth to, to kite him out. And then you're dead. Yep, no, just like that. Nope, just like that. I'm done. I, sh I should be done. You know when a game makes you go, man, fuck this shit. And then you keep playing it, sort of out of spite. It's like, oh, you think you can beat me, game? I'll get you eventually. No, I don't want to deal with any of this. Like that. Kind of. Oh, gosh. Okay. No, oh, that threw off the pattern. That was me specifically trying to bait it. That was hubris. No! But I want it! Okay. Just stick. Just worry about survivability. Swing where you can. See, that's actually the problem, is that, like, getting all the way into that corner ruins you because then the bullets are so angled you can't come back out. Yeah. Survivability. That's what I'm looking at right now. Aliens go home, run, survive. Kojima's not connected with this one either. Ugh. God, they're so protected too. Ah! Slide cam's out too late. So many bullets. The ball's just gonna stop over there, isn't it? Ugh. Ah. Oh, I got the hit. And there's the heal. Okay. Whoops. All right. Not all right. Ah! 
I went for the swing! I went for the swing and I couldn't slide! Mm. Couldn't make up my mind. You gotta... You can't be wishy-washy about those slides. You can't try and do something and then slide as an afterthought. It's like, nope, I'm sliding here. Okay. I like that. The little bit of invulnerability from bullets as you come out of the slide. I don't, I don't think I'm just imagining that. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get out of the corner. Ball, help. Come on! Come on, Lynn! Yes! Okay! Oh, jeez Louise. Oh. I'm not... I'm done. Listen, I know there's more game, but I'm done. Oh, my gosh. Okay. That was exciting. Um, hey, maybe... Is it, like, super fascinating and, like, got clever, like, boss designs and stuff? Uh, a, a little at the core. Maybe not so much with the progression, but at the core, it's got some stuff that I appreciate a lot. Good, like, control of the ball. Good, like, combination of, of mechanics, like, known mechanics. Gravity on the ball. Like, discrete angles for hitting. Uh, uh, angle modifiers with, like, the up and the scooch and the, yeah, no, good stuff there. Um, and then apparently some balls hard stages that are really satisfying to complete. Oh my gosh, okay. This is Aliens Go Home Run. It's for like two bucks on Steam. You should probably go get it if you like banging your head against the game and then finally yelling in congratulations to yourself. Like I just did. My hands are completely over my face. I can't, I don't want to look at anything. Oh, thank you for joining me. Ugh. Ah!